You're watching Gabe Eat Stuff. Zoinks, zoinks, zoinks. The show where I try things that people eat all the time, but for some reason, I have never eaten before. Like, subscribe, comment below. Today, we'll be trying an apple. Apple, 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 apple. So, what do I know about apples? Well, they make all my favorite stuff. Just kidding. You know what I mean, phones. Oh. Gabe. <laughs> Gabe. Gabe. <laughs> Is he looking? Before I forget, this month's sponsor I must mention, Glade Plugins. Forgot to mention it last episode and people got upset. Oh yeah, Gabe. My, me and my mom, we love Glade Plugins for real big time. Please let me touch you. My mom's <laughs> awesome too. Guys, how much debt is too much? Let's do this. Mmm. Mm, I like that it's crunchy, but it's sour and wet. I'm not a big fan of that. Also, the packaging is pretty lame. Do they all have juice? Oh, can you believe this? Wait, what's he end up bringing the apple? It doesn't matter, Kristen. A man eating fruit is not news. It has two million views. <sighs> Meanwhile, my post on human trafficking in Sudan is doing horribly. Forgot for a second that traffic can be a bad thing when not related to the internet. Traffic is usually a bad thing, Kristen. <sighs> this job has changed us. I hate to say it, but there's something really charismatic about Gabe. Doobity 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 doobity. You should think about asking him for advice. <sighs> You're right. <gasps> Did you wash your hands before touching your phone? Oh, come on, Astrid. The only person touching my phone or my butt is me. Okay, but check my tweets about Hepe, all right? Later, skater. Be content. I like that you're prioritizing happiness. It's be content. It's a reminder that we're all made of viral stories. Oh, I like to believe we all have a story to tell too. Well, it's more like everyone has a video of their best friend falling down the stairs that they email me secretly, and I just share it with the world, but sure. I don't wanna bother you while you're writing, but I was wondering if I could ask you for some advice. My articles, nobody clicks on them. Let's pretend for a second that this succulent here is viral content. And this stapler is boring old journalism. Everyone loves succulents. Even the most laziest person in the world can take care of them. They're cool, yet nobody knows why. This stapler, it's boring. It reminds me of a time before we had cell phones. <laughs> Ugh. What I'm trying to say is, you gotta make content that's more like this succulent. Give the people what they want. Approach it from your personal brand. Here. You want my advice? You're a woman. That's an angle. Talk about body positivity or whatever. Try that French girl look. Man spread on the subway for a week and talk about how it empowered you. Got it. Thanks. <laughs> Oh, it is you. Sorry, did I ignore you in the kitchen earlier? I just assumed you were like a visiting mime or something. Ah, uh, c'est moi. Wait, are you a mime? Mimes don't speak French. Listen, if you are a mime, there's something I have to tell you before it's too late. <laughs> no, sorry. It's me. Gabe said I should try with the French girl look to get more clicks. Oh, yeah, love that look. It's so mime? Yeah, I don't know what it means either. Anyway, Toby told me there's a strange person wandering around the office. She has no idea how they got in. Miss. What? Should we leave? No, she's harmless. Security's on it. 
apparently she just looks like some sad lady attending a poetry slam. Hey, there she is. Oh my God, Kristen, it's me. They think I'm somebody else because of my French girl look. Wait, no, officer, don't tackle her. She works here. I'm not the right person. Eat mime, stay down. No, I'm not the right person. <sighs> Moving. Now who will deliver my message to the mime army? 564 on fire six. We're clear. 